two years ago, the middle of summer, Bob had a slight episode of a stroke. And I was able to understand, obviously, that he was in need of a medical emergency. And I drove him to the emergency room at Catholic Medical Center. It was a Friday afternoon. All of the rooms were at capacity. People were waiting, um, but they brought him in immediately and started to go through the stroke symptoms. Upon entering the trauma room, they brought in a monitor with teleneurology. They had a neurologist standing by, it's the national network. I had a doctor from Flagstaff, Arizona, monitoring my case, reading all of the vitals, and basically uh, sitting at the foot of my bed. We're all familiar with Zoom meetings and everything on screen right now, but this is really at the vanguard of the movement. I spent the next five days in intensive care. The nurses were in and out every seven or eight minutes. They monitored everything. Care was very attentive. The capital campaign, which is really for the expansion at the hospital, is critical. Unfortunately, Catholic Medical Center needs additional emergency rooms. The demand is there. We saw it when Bob was brought in that there was no space. We were in a, a six by eight foot room. So this campaign is vital. It is desperately needed to match the needs of not only the community, but also for the state of New Hampshire. When you're having a stroke or about to have a stroke, they say time is tissue and the clock is ticking and you gotta get someplace and get care immediately. So Manchester is centrally located in New Hampshire and it's very important that we have good hospitals and good good care, good medical care. We are so fortunate to have Catholic Medical Center here today, but we need to continue to support it financially. We need to make sure that it continues to be the flagship hospital in cardiovascular care. Technology is great, but it comes at a price, and we need to make sure that the hospital is here with the services and the technology and the doctors and the staff to provide it to us today and in future years.